Hey fellow drone nerds, thanks for joining us today. My name is Jill Kearns and today I want to talk about the DJI Avada as an enterprise drone and uh, two options you get with it that can better suit a use case. Uh, so right now with the Avada, as you can see, it comes with these new goggles right here, kind of the update to the previous FPV goggles by DJI. And then yes, here is the Avada. So small, uh, you know, forgiving when to fly but still has this like uh, you know FPV style drone that you can get in those spaces that you couldn't with something else and also again forgiveness it can bounce off such right itself back up from turtle mode all those different things a wonderful product and the use cases in enterprise are continually popping up right now but something there is two different options with the drone and those are two different controllers that actually that you could use with the drone. One, you have the controller that actually comes with the FP, with the actual Avada, and that is the motion controller. So this trigger enabled uh, accelerometer style uh, controller is uh, it, it, it's great. You get this uh, this other like like machine and human kind of uh, flight and body when you're flying this drone, going place to go forward. Uh, yaw left, yawing right. You can also transfer the yaw to the actual motion on the on the goggles, which is great. So looking left, looking right, you can the drone will actually tilt and turn, yawing different directions with it. But the uh, the ability with this is the more and more practice I've had with this controller, the more I love it, and the more I feel even more comfortable with it. Uh, and it just it's great. It, you have this awesome brain breaking motion to it, I'm just a big fan. Now, in Enterprise, I see this uh, as being great use when you're, you know, maybe taking this out of a backpack. It also is a smaller form factor right here and being able to have a small kit that maybe you could fly a job site at the end of the day and just get that quick video of perspective that can be turned into those overseeing the project or or something in that nature. But again, this is just a wonderful way to get uh, even more man and machine kind of movement. Uh, the other controller, which is kind of what we're all used to and came with the last FPV drone by DJI, uh, this is your typical controller. This is what we're used to. This is uh, that style and, and honestly, I mean, going back and forth between them, uh, you know, I, I fly, uh, I've been flying, I flew more with this when I originally got this product because I was used to this and I knew it and it was great. Um, which makes a standard pretty well. So uh, public safety, I think this is a great option. Um, you can immediately, anybody who's flown a drone, you can just hand it to them and they immediately can pick this up and be able to operate this in the way you want and be able to fly in. So uh, two controllers for the Avada and two different use cases. I mean, you know, both the same, but yet it's a little different. Uh, again, easier and, and I think way not just, I don't want to say fun, I mean, yeah, it is a lot of fun, but it, it, I think it's a better man and machine and you start to, to, to use this a little bit better and it's also great because it's a small form factor, but then you have this, which is kind of classic and you can just immediately hand this to somebody where I see public safety utilizing this a lot more as, as one that you can just hand to uh, the, the next uh, remote piloted command to be able to take over and so on. So uh, great, both wonderful, but you know, if there are any other questions that we can dive in for this, please reach out to us at experts at drone nerds.com. Otherwise we'd love to guide you through and find the right solution for you. But hey, thanks for joining us. Have a great rest of the day. Safe flying. See ya.